Catholic Parish. I'm Father Martin, pastor here. I just welcome you to Wednesday. And as you remember, every Wednesday um, since COVID has started, since we started these live streams, every Wednesday we've been praying a rosary. And today's rosary is for our school, our kids' schools, that we always um, remember our kids and we always remember our school teachers and all of our administrative office as well. We ask that God, you continue to illuminate their hearts and their minds, that they have a successful school year. So it's never too early to start praying for a successful school year. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. I believe in God, the Father, the Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell, and on the third day he rose again from the dead. He is ascended into heaven, and it is seated at the right hand of God the Father the Almighty. From there he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, and the resurrection of the body and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. The next three Hail Marys are for the faith, hope, and love. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Our first joyful mystery, the Annunciation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. And give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. 
Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those who most need of thy mercy. The second joyful mystery is the visitation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who most need of thy mercy. The third joyful mystery is the Nativity. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus. Forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who most need of thy mercy. The fourth joyful mystery is the presentation of our Lord Jesus in the temple. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who most need of thy mercy. The fifth joyful mystery is the finding of Jesus in the temple. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we stand up our sighs, mourning and weeping in the valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, the eyes of mercy towards us. And after this, our exile, show, un, show, us un, show <laughs> unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be worthy of the promises of Christ. Well, good afternoon, brothers and sisters, and welcome to St. Mary's Catholic Parish. I'm Father Martin, your pastor here, along with our brand new deacon, Deacon Jim Adloff. We welcome him, and we're so glad and excited to have him here serving Mass with us. And as well, we have our seminarian over here, William. As always, we are so glad to be here, and we're glad that you're here to, um, to pray with us. Brothers and sisters, today's Mass is going to be offered for the intentions of Anita Conrad. Anita Conrad, in the name of the Father, and the Son, and Holy Spirit, amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all and with your spirit. Brothers and sisters, let us all, let us acknowledge all our sins and prepare ourselves to celebrate the sacred mysteries. I confess to Almighty God, and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned, both in my thoughts and in my words, in what I have done and in what I have failed to do, through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. And therefore, I ask the Blessed Mary, ever Virgin, all the angels and saints, and to you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, Forgive us our sins and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Let us pray. O God, who in the abasement of your Son has raised up a fallen world, fill your faithful with the holy joy for, the, for on those you have rescued from slavery to sin, you bestow eternal gladness. 
through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. My brothers and sisters, let us all be seated as we listen attentively to our readings. A reading from the book of the prophet Hosea. Israel is a luxuriant vine whose fruit matches its growth. The more abundant his fruit, the more altars he built. The more productive his land, the more sacred pillars he set up. Their heart is false. Now they pay for their guilt. God shall break down their altars and destroy their sacred pillars. If they would say, we have no king, since they do not fear the Lord, what can the king do for them? The king of Samaria shall disappear like foam upon the waters. The high places of Avon shall be destroyed, the sin of Israel. Thorns and thistles shall overgrow their altars. Then they shall cry out to the mountains, cover us, and to the hills, fall upon us. Sow for yourselves justice. Reap the fruit of piety. Break up for yourselves a new field. For it is time to seek the Lord. Till he come and rain down justice upon you. The word of the Lord. Thanks Thanks be to God. Seek always the face of the Lord. Seek always the face of the Lord. Sing to him, sing his praise, proclaim all his wondrous deeds. Glory in his holy name. Rejoice, O hearts that seek the Lord. Seek always the face of the Lord. Look to the Lord in his strength. Seek to serve him constantly. Recall the wondrous deeds that he has wrought, his portents and the judgments he has uttered. Seek always the face of the Lord. You descendants of Abraham, his servants, sons of Jacob, his chosen ones, he the Lord is our God. Throughout the earth his judgments prevail. Seek Seek always the face of the Lord. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. The kingdom of God is at hand. Repent and believe in the gospel. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A read from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory to the Lord. Jesus summoned his twelve disciples and gave them authority over unclean spirits to drive them out and to cure every disease and every illness. The names of the twelve apostles are these. First, Simon called Peter and his brother Andrew, James the son of Zebedee and his brother John, Philip and Bartholomew, Thomas and Matthew the tax collector, James, the son of Alphaeus and Thaddeus, Simon, the Canaanian, and Judas Iscariot, who betrayed Jesus. Jesus sent out these twelve after instructing them thus, Do not go into pagan territory or enter a Samaritan town. Go rather to the lost sheep of the house of Israel. As you go, make this proclamation. The kingdom of heaven is at hand. The gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Well, good afternoon, brothers and sisters, and welcome to St. Mary's Catholic Church. Um, Again, thank you, Deacon Jim, for reading that gospel reading. How ironic, though, you know, that we are doing Mass today for our, for the future church for the future school of St. Mary's for our teachers and for um, the administrators in the office 
and how beautiful that it ties in perfectly with today's readings. Why? Well, today's readings come from chapter 10 of Matthew. Well, what has happened in, from chapter 5 to chapter 10 is Jesus teaching. Jesus in chapter 5 was teaching up on the mount, right? He was giving the instructions on how we are called to live our lives with the, with commu- with, um, the commandments and the beatitudes, the gifts that we receive afterwards. Then in chapter 7, 8, 9, here in the midst of all of these things that were happening, what was he doing? He was teaching us how to put our faith into action by healing. So we, he, he started to heal all these people who had faith. He started to chase out the, the demons out of them. And now today, in chapter 10, chapter 10 of 27 chapters. So he's got 17 chapters before he leaves us, right? He's here to teach and to create disciples to carry this mission of his forward. Right? And so he creates, he names these 12 disciples to continue his work here on earth. Continue to teach them all the things that he has already done, right? To give them the power and the strength and the courage to do his work here on earth. Well, that's exactly what we do at our school. In our school at St. Mary's Catholic School, we have a four foundations that we work on. First and foremost is our identity as children of God. First and foremost, without anything else. We then seek academics. You know, we have many different types of academics there. Most importantly, we have STEM, which is science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. Phenomenal. But that's not the only thing that we have. And our next foundation, our third one, is the music, the arts, right? So we have a wonderful arts department there. And finally, our sports. In these orders of importance, first and foremost importance is a relationship with our Lord Jesus Christ. And here in the midst of this, we are teaching our kids about Jesus. And it's our job as parents to teach our kids because they're going to be the next generation to keep their faith alive, to keep the faith of 2,000 years alive and continue it to continue to grow even larger than what it is. But it is our responsibility, my responsibility as a pastor, Jim's responsibility as a deacon, William's responsibility as a future pastor, our teacher's responsibilities, our principal and administrators at our school's responsibility to teach our kids the next generation. But it's also our parents to teach them about our Lord. Because where, where, where else are you going to learn about it than in your home? Here, we have about 30-minute relationship with the Lord 30 minutes worth of mass. We have to teach at home. We have to teach in our schools about our Lord Jesus Christ. Why? For the exact same reason that Jesus is teaching his disciples today. He's naming them. So that way the kingdom of heaven will continue to grow here on earth. Brothers and sisters, it is our job, our vocation, as disciples of Christ, to continue to form the next generation and understanding and coming to know and love our Lord Jesus Christ. So brothers and sisters, that's the challenge that we have been placed today. And I'm glad and I'm very proud to say that St. Mary's Catholic Church focuses on the main foundations of her, which is relationship with our Lord Christ. And I know that this next year that we're coming up to is going to be a phenomenal year in the growth of our kids. So, brothers and sisters, I look forward to having a new generation of kids come through this school and learn about our Lord Jesus Christ. Let us all stand and offer our prayers and petitions for our brothers and sisters throughout the whole world, for Pope Francis, cardinals and bishops, and all of those who hand on the Catholic faith, that God, you will continue to illuminate their hearts and their minds to do your will. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayers. For our presidents and business leaders and all governor leaders, those who instill rules and regulations on how we are called to live the secular life, 
we ask, Lord, that you continue to guard their hearts and their minds to seek your ways first. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayers. For all of our first respondents, those men and women who give their life to make sure that we are kept healthy and that we are kept safe in our homes, we ask that you give them courage and strength to continue their, their mission. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For all of our children that go to St. Mary's School, for our teachers and administrators as they continue to gear up for a new, a new season, a new school year, we ask you continue to illuminate all of their hearts and their minds to do your will. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For all our brothers and sisters who are sick, those who are sick with COVID or whatever other disease they may or may have, they may have, that God, you will be there to be there and aid to them. That you will send your healing power upon them. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. And for all our brothers and sisters who have passed away, those who will bury this week and those who will continue to die this week, that you will be there to console those left behind and you will be there to open the, pearl, the gates of heaven to the souls that seek to enter. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. And finally, for all the prayers that we hold in the silence of our hearts. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Gracious and loving God, we thank you for the many gifts you have bestowed upon us, and we thank you for this beautiful day. We ask that, Heavenly Father, that you hear the prayers that we present to you at this altar, and we ask that you answer them according to your will. We ask this through the intercession of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. My brothers and sisters, let us all be seated as we prepare the altar. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the bread we offer you, fruit of the earth and work of human hands that will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the vine and work of human hands that will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. With the humble spirit and contrite heart, may we be accepted by you, Lord, and may our sacrifice in your sight this day be pleasing to you, Lord God. Lord, wash away my iniquities and cleanse me from my sins. Pray, brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept this sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and for all his holy church. May this oblation dedicated to your name purify us, O Lord, and day by day bring our conduct closer to the life of heaven. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. And the Lord be with you, with your spirit. Lift up your hearts, for we lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere to give you thanks. Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, for in goodness you created man, and when he was justly condemned, in mercy you redeemed him through Christ our Lord. Through him the angels praise your majesty, dominions adore, and the powers tremble before you. Heavens and the virtues of heavens and the blessed seraphims worship together with exaltation. May our voices, we pray, join with theirs in humble praise as we acclaim. Holy, holy, holy Lord, God of hosts, heaven and earth are full of your glory. Osana in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Osana in the highest. My brothers and sisters, let us all kneel. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down the Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks, broke it and gave it to his disciples, saying,
take this, all of you, and eat of it. For this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. We proclaim your death, O Lord, and profess your resurrection until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly, we pray that, partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity. Together with Francis, our Pope, Edward, our Bishop, Gregory, our Auxiliary Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection. And all who have died in your mercy, welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray. That with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with Blessed Joseph, her spouse, with your blessed apostles and with all your saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. My brothers and sisters, let us all rise. At the Savior's command and form by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our day that by the help of your mercy we may always be free from sin and safe from all distress as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom and the power and the glory are yours now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace, I leave you my peace, I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always, and with your spirit. Lamb of God. You take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. Brothers and sisters, let us all kneel. Behold the Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those who are called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word and my soul shall be healed.
My brothers and sisters, while at this time not all of us can participate of the body and blood of Christ, we can participate in a communion prayer, one which brings us closer to our Lord. And let us all pray the act of spiritual communion. My Jesus, I believe that you are present in the most holy sacrament. I love you above all things, and I desire to receive you into my soul. Since I cannot at this moment receive you sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. Come into my heart. I embrace you as if you were already there and unite myself wholly to you. Never permit me to be separated from you. Amen. Let us pray. Grant, we pray, O Lord, that having replenished by such great gifts, we may gain the prize of salvation and never cease to praise you. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Brothers and sisters, we'd like to thank you for worshiping with us. In a special way, welcome to all of our family and friends on YouTube channel, our, our personal website channel, and our Facebook channel. We are glad that you are here wor worshiping with us couple of quick announcements. So registration is con is going on right now for our school. Uh, St. Mary's School is taking applications right now for new students. So all are welcome. So if you haven't thought about it, I definitely would think about registering your kids to go to our school. Um, thank you to all of our men and women who came out and volunteered and helped this afternoon distribute food. We served a lot of families and we thank you it was really hot so a little smelly here and there but you know a little sweat never killed anybody but it was it was a fun event and we are so glad that you came out and helped us um so if you missed this opportunity that's not the only opportunity we have hannah and our youth department is starting a, a program on july the 13th through the 17th on how we can also be the hands of our lord and just be do acts of charity for um, for those in need. So if you've missed it, an opportunity this time around, next week, again, we will have that opportunity. Check our website for more details and our Facebook channel for more details on it. I don't have all of the details how this works. I know that I got signed up somehow, maybe because I'm the pastor, I don't know. But <laughs> I will be there with you all working hard at whatever Hannah's has and plan for us. Hannah, our youth director. Um, again, thank you and welcome to uh, Jim Adloff to the altar as a deacon. We are glad that you're here and we're glad that you're serving with us. So thank you very much. And again, thank you again to William and to Juan for um, also being here and helping us throughout the masses and all the different events that are happening throughout um, the church. We are glad that you all are here. I think that's our bit of our announcements, but um, look towards our flock notes that are going to be coming out. Uh, there will be another one coming out either Thursday or Friday. So, Lord be with you and with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen. Mass is ended. Go forth. Thanks be to God. Have a beautiful day. God bless. Take care.